Greetings, Monster Hunters! Brutal Severity here with Lorelei, and you're watching my Monster Hunter 3 Ultimate Online Let's Play. Now, last time we took care of a Baleful Giganox and a Jade Baroth. And now we just got a Jade Baroth by itself. So, I'm going to use the hammer this time. And, uh, Lorelei is going to use a longsword. Now, there is a danger attached to this quest, so we might run into a... Devil Joe or Lagambi or something like that. Nothing we can't handle, of course. We got uh, some pretty powerful weaponry. He's in the middle. Oh, damn it. Stopped in his tracks. Now the Jay Baroth has that stupid headbutt move where he headbutts twice. Whoa! Damn it. What? That works. I don't know if there's many, uh, like, great J. Baroth ice weapons. I just know that I like the hammer. But I don't know if we're gonna need to farm this guy or not. I'm taking a lot of hits. I'm being reckless. I got this. Don't move. That's a knockout. Once your spear gauge is full. What? I was right in front of his face. The 
thing about the spirit gauge is that once it's full and it and the gauge blinks, then uh, it won't decrease unless it gets under a certain certain threshold. But if you haven't reached the top yet, then it'll slowly decrease. That's all you, buddy. Oh, nice! Mid charge? Crap. Wait, what was that? The Jade Wrath has no rare parts, right? Pretty sure. He just has basic stuff and There's no uh Baroth Ruby or anything like that. You're not going anywhere. Nice. 
Nighty night! I think I've only gotten a rust, uh, rust stone or a rust shard or whatever, like once in the tundra. All right, let's see what we got here. Basic stuff. Wyvern stone. Frozen globs. Alrighty guys, like always, thanks for watching. Remember to like, comment, favorite, and subscribe. And we'll be back with some more Monster Hunter. Brutal Severity and Lorelei out.